Shook it up. Good morning, people. Today is Thursday. It is infinite day in solitude. No, realistically. <clears throat> so today is the 26th of March. We have been stuck in the house for about a week and uh, I'm not complaining. We have enough facilities to look after us. And um, just trying to get through some home workouts which are absolutely saturating the internet right now. So there's literally zero excuse. I think people are gonna come out of confinement um, super fit and probably cancel all of their gym memberships because they're going to realise they never went to the gym and working out at home is far more fun. There, that's a bit better. No one needs to see my face that up close first thing in the morning. So I'm going to take you through my day. Today we are going to brave the supermarket. Haven't been in the supermarket in probably about two weeks. I managed to get a home delivery last week but here in the UK all the delivery slots are gone so I am going to have to go and try and get some food and supplies for the weekend. Um, it's been hard to get things like chicken Um managed to get some toilet paper so our butts are fine for all those concerned and um, they're starting to worry about uh, running out of wine because people in quarantine apparently drink a lot more. I know I do. So yeah, they've decided to open up the um, off licenses to make alcohol available to everyone in this tough time. But uh, I'm just gonna go and have a brew now and see my doggies and get on with my day. Damn that smell, saffrosy, while I'm at a far slim and a same basty, a same pump, while I lot of long jay, think a main coach shadow where the crew and I lay, turn out the stage, sing a son of the smell, bump their hair when I sell it out seats, and I make them bend, get my ass started with a pair of light. Boom! Here comes the slow-mo. Who provided you with the... <laughs> Lex never gives me credit on his Instagram for the fact that I make all his food. He looks like this epic chef and he doesn't do any of it himself. <laughs> oh there now, we'll, we'll not be having none of these cameras here now. If you don't mind, we'll be shutting that down. The Lex doesn't appear in the mornings on no camera. So if you... Close, Roxy Rooster. Oh, 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 because she's out cold, out cold. Oh, well, we've been hit so hard, I don't know what day of the week it is no more. Oh, the only thing that could save me now would be biscuits. Oh no. Four biscuits. To be precise. Oh. <laughs> oh. Pug puncher. No pugs were harmed in the making of this behind the scenes Except video. This pug. Yeah, she looks so oh. sick. Oh. Can you hear the darkness close in it? I've had a coffee and now I'm going to use my little at home stepper. If I can find one available online, I will link it down below, just a similar one. But I've had this for ages. Um, a lot of equipment right now, gym equipment and resistance bands have sold out online because obviously everyone's 
working out from home. We tried to order an at-home gym equipment piece, but the order got cancelled because obviously they ran out and they're prioritising getting all the gym equipment to the army and the military and things like that. So, um, we're lucky enough that I always have resistance bands anyway, and I have medicine balls, and I have loads of different bits and bobs uh, that I use at home pretty much weekly anyway. So, we can just get along with that and do some HIIT workouts and things like that. So not gonna complain we're all in this together this is a global experience i suppose in generations to come we'll be able to say that we lived through it and uh it's one day closer to getting out and being free from the virus so don't complain just get on with it it is what it is pain in the butt I've got my water and I've added a sachet of the uh, Milky Almond H2O infusion from Prozis. It has 2,000 milligrams of vitamin C in it. Now, vitamin C is essential for immunity. Vitamin C tablets that you get from the supermarket or from the chemist, whatever, they only have 1,000 milligrams. So this has double the amount and it flavours your water. It's sweetened with stevia so nothing bad in there and it'll just encourage you to drink water because right now we're meant to be drinking liquids so that if the virus does get into us which we hope it doesn't that at least we can wash it down into our stomach and then it's like neutralized pretty much there so keep yourself hydrated when you're at home hot drinks or water and your vitamin c just to keep your immunity up because if you do get a bug and you're stuck at home you don't want to be going to the um, hospital or to the doctors right now you just want to be able to fight it off at home you may not get coronavirus but if you get any kind of cold or flu you just want to be able to fight it off right now with your own immunity so we'll do everything to um increase our own immunity right now which is vitamin c zinc um, loads of fruit and veg, try and keep it fresh as possible and uh, keep yourself moving. Right now in the UK we're allowed to have um, one kind of outdoor excursion for exercise which for me obviously um, it's not as much as I'm used to because I usually go out with the dogs twice a day um, but for a lot of people who are working nine to five this one um, one outlet of exercise a day is probably more than they're used to so hopefully um, the bright side is that people will come out of uh, the quarantine period and they'll actually be fitter and healthier a lot of people are spending time with their family they're getting things done around the house that they haven't been able to get done so hopefully we'll all get out of this maybe with grey hair because we can't get to the hairdressers and maybe with no eyelashes because we can't get to the salon but we might get out of it looking like fit potatoes.
Was it a good workout? Bailey. 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 You're not talking to me. Was it a bit too tough for you? No. Oh. So I decided to get my workout in early, um, looking quite dishevelled. And I'm gonna go have some breakfast now, if you have some oats. It's absolutely a stunning day out. We've been quite blessed in the fact that we're stuck at home, but at least it's not wet and miserable to look out at. And uh, gonna go have some breakfast and then go grocery shopping. Um, my outfit here is from Prozis and um, I'm gonna be running a big competition in April for my birthday and you'll be in with a chance to win a voucher and uh, I'd really like you to enter. So stay tuned to Prozis and to my Instagram page um, for that because that's coming in April and if you want to purchase any Prozis stuff, they actually have a lot of food as well, egg whites, things like that that you can put in the freezer, breads. So if you're struggling to stay on track, go and check out the website, I'll link it down below. And um, if you use Lainey, not only do you get 10% off, but you'll also get a load of free goodies. So go check that out. And me and Roxy are gonna go and have some breakfast. Breakfast this morning, we have some porridge oats. So I've got about 50 gram porridge oats and I bulk it out with some high fiber bran because I probably am getting in enough fiber right now, um, just not getting in enough fruit and veg. We add water to the oats and the bran, microwave for one minute, then add in 50 grams of the egg whites, uh, microwave for 30 seconds, stir, microwave again for 30 seconds, then then we add in a scoop of the polypeptide collagen plus this is the vanilla flavor and again just stir it thoroughly through you may need to add a little bit of extra water microwave for 30 seconds again and then top with one of these um, zero milk chocolate bars to make it all so chocolatey goodness yummy so I'm gonna have this and then I may go to the supermarket Through isolation, I'm still getting my caffeine fix. That has not reduced. And I have developed a slight addiction to the yummy drops in my coffee. They're so good. And the hamburg size, so. The marzipan is my flavor. The marzipan is my favorite flavor, but I also have maple, praline, and caramel. And they're all really good, but marzipan, I just love anything marzipan, almondy flavor. So I'm gonna have a coffee now. Maybe do something with this beautiful face. I've got a big zit healing here. And uh, yeah. Since we are now limited in reasons to get dressed up, I try to make an effort every couple of days to do my hair, put on some regular clothes. And uh, yes, I'm wearing heels, skirt, the sun is shining. My entire outfit's from Nasty Gal because I am addicted to Nasty Gal. Like these boots. I just love them. They make me super tall. I haven't really done many um, regular clothing try-ons, so if you'd like to see me do a Nasty Gal try-on while we're in quarantine and I've got more opportunities to do things from home, just comment down below. Um, Nasty Gal, ASOS, they're kind of like my two favourite online retailers and obviously they're still delivering during this time. So, and this is not at all an ad. I wish it was, I wish I was affiliated with them. But uh, right now, since I've got a cute outfit on, I think I'm gonna go and do some grocery shopping. Give people something to talk about, about the girl who got ridiculously dressed up to go to the supermarket. Oh well, they still have entertainment. So I'm in from doing the grocery shopping and it was a lot less eventful than I thought it would be. Luckily, um, the stocks in the supermarket here seem to have replenished a bit. There's a few things that are a bit short, like um, ice cream for some reason. I'm guessing it's because the kids are off and it's nicer weather and yeah. Ice cream stocks are very depleted, but they did have some of the enlightened Ben and Jerry's, so I'm okay. It was more Alexa's full fat clotted cream one that was gone. So um, I'm in, 
I've walked the dogs, I've put away the groceries. I'm um, feeling quite anxious because, um, maybe you don't know this, I'm a bit of a germaphobe. I get my groceries delivered to the house normally, so it was a bit of an uh, unpleasant experience to have to go to the supermarket in the midst of a pandemic when there's people there in the vicinity and to be honest I'm not a very tactile person I don't really like people being too close to me in general that I don't know and aren't my family or friends so I'm now treating myself to a glass of wine I've walked the dogs brought them out to a field to have the poops kept a social distance from everyone I bought some flowers for the house because we're stuck in here so I have daffodils and roses and tulips all around the house and lilies um, and hopefully for my birthday that's what I'd like to get from people is some flowers to cheer up my surroundings because I like them to look at and they're pretty and I got a new scented candle so the place smells nice I disinfected all the countertops where the groceries came into because I'm just wary about you know the products having been in a public forum and now they're in our house so just trying to cover my bases when I came in as well I made sure I had a hot drink because they say that even if the virus gets into your mouth it takes a couple of days for it to get down onto your lungs so drink hot drinks wash it through down into your stomach where it'll be killed off and now I'm going to do some more disinfecting with some rosé wine and um then I'm getting on with dinner. I'm just going to make, I managed to get some chicken breasts. Hallelujah. So because I got chicken breasts, I can make us a chicken stir fry. I got some fresh veggies. So it'll be um, onions, peppers, some rice. And um, I already have like the Thai green curry paste that I always use. So I haven't been doing any hoarding or, um, you know, filling my pantry with things I don't really need. I just have enough to do me for the week. So I spent a hundred pounds and that, inclined, that included flowers and a bottle of wine. So I didn't do any excessive shopping. I got enough eggs for us for the week. I got enough milk, bread, things like that. Just the basics, but I didn't overdo it. We have enough toilet paper in our household, so I didn't get any more toilet paper. And um, we'll be fine for another week. And then I'll go grocery shopping again uh, next week. And that will be my outing next week. Very exciting times. So here's to me, my wine. I hope you're all safe. I hope this has entertained you for however long this video is. Um, go check out my Instagram. I'm putting up um, daily videos, daily up, um, uploads on my progress because right now I'm still doing my Shape 38. So I'm sticking to my macros apart from a cheeky glass of wine. Um, I'm getting some form of resistance training do, done maybe not weight training but i've got my resistance bands as you've seen uh getting some cardio in getting steps in with the dogs for their daily exercise and um i'm trying to get enough sleep but it has been a struggle since um i just feel very anxious and it's disturbing my sleep a bit but again drink your water stay healthy stay happy Download Netflix if you don't already have it. Download Now TV. Get some board games out. Spend time with your family. And um, just stay safe, guys. Love you. Yeah, I'm Superman. I spend my time flying high, going round, but I'm always getting wayside. Some people trying to shit on me. I said, girl, you can sit on me. Because, bitch, they be hating.